What do we want Texas to be like for our third century? We formed Texas 2036 to make sure that Texas remains the number one place to live, to do business, and to raise a family. My life experiences tell me that you can really deal with things if you'll take the long-term view, if you'll act before you have a crisis. Texas is rising right now. We need to take action to make sure that we keep that momentum. And I think if you show people that there are real issues to deal with and you present them with solutions, they'll address those. Our population has been growing rapidly, which is good. But how do you accommodate that growth? How do you move people around? How do you get people to jobs? How do you keep the quality of life? We, the people of Texas, understand there's some issues that we need to address to make sure that we remain the best place to be. Healthcare has to be efficient and effective. You have to deal with the cost side as well as the quality side. You have to have the essential infrastructure that make our society work. And our infrastructure growth has not kept up with our population growth. To keep us a viable state in terms of people having a well-paid job, we've got to up our game in education and workforce development. How do we maintain the right balance of how to utilize natural resources so there's plenty of resources for my grandchildren, great-grandchildren. We need to make sure people feel safe. They need to know where to go for help. Those are fundamentals of any functioning society. Do you have an effective, lean government that knows how to deliver those services? We, the people of Texas, need to present a united front that we want these issues dealt with in a constructive way, in a long-term way, in a real way, because we need to really shape and refine what should be the future of our state. What do you want it to be? It wasn't easy to get to where we are today from where we began 200 years ago, and we need to all pull together to make sure that Texas remains that special place.